What's going on everyone? Welcome back to Keep Halloween Alive, the third season, which is crazy to think about that it's been three years. But anyway, I'm going to show you my after Halloween sale shopping that I did. Not too many items, but I'm going to go over them here with you. The first thing I got, and I'm serious this year, I just ran out of time and I also ran out of ideas to do my table. I really want to crack down and make my table something really unique this coming Halloween, which seems like forever, but it will be here before we know it. As I said, the days keep going by and the years keep going faster and faster, so it will be here soon. The first thing the guy, it looks like one of those uh, cake decorator, cake decorator, I mean cake holders, but it just says Moody Manor on it, and it used to be 20 bucks, but it was $10 for the half off sale. has a mirror on it, and I'll show you close ups of it, of course, but had the idea with these two little pumpkins I got. Maybe I could put like something like that there. Actually, no, that don't look right. But maybe something on this might make it look cool on the table. Next thing up, I, these little pumpkins were $3.99 each, so I got them two bucks each. One has a bat on it, and one has a spider on it. Not sure if it's clay or if it's just a hard plastic, I'm not sure. But Anyway, I thought these were pretty cool. That might be a nice decorative item on the table, which means I might need to get a new replacement. Uh, I don't know what kind of cover I might get, but we'll, we'll talk about it more as the episodes keep rolling along. I'll update you with ideas I have. And the next item that I picked up is this skull in this little bird looking cage. The original price was $24.99. So I had to pick that up. I thought that'd be a good deal half off. And I really like it. You can open up the bird cage. I'm not sure. No, the skull don't come out. I didn't even try that at the store. But maybe I can put like some kind of light down on each side to illuminate it at nighttime maybe. Or maybe I can put some kind of like LEDs in its eyeballs or something. I don't know. I'll think about something. Next thing I got is this coffin looking sign. But of course it's about a witch. I love witches. $9.99 original price, so I had to get that. Thought that would look cool in the Halloween restroom. Let me hang it up and I'll show you what it looks like. Well, first I'll show you the close up. The last thing I got, this sign's way too cool. It's one of these yard signs, and man, this thing's pretty freaking big. I like it. It's a big, humongous rest in peace sign with a crow on it. I had to get this, and I'm not sure why it has this on there. I don't think anyone would want to do that. You might as well just stab it into the ground with these big, humongous shirt pieces on the end, but I can't remember the original price because I I did this shopping a few days ago and I'm doing this video now because I've been sick, been going to work a lot, overtime, you know, got to get that money. But anyway, I thought that would be cool to have in the yard next year. And that's going to do it for this part. So now let's jump on the computer and look around and see what else we can find. Okay, some of the major websites that you'll want to pay attention to is Party City. This is one of them because they got all kinds of Halloween decorations and from costumes and accessories, they got a lot of those in stock and on sale. So you, you could do your costume shopping early for next year. Spirit Halloween's the major one to always go to because you can buy all kinds of good stuff all year round, but they also have a sale selection that you'll want to check out. And Target as well. They got quite a bit of good stuff on this webpage to where I was like, hmm, I won't mind buying that. But let me know in the comments below if you bought any sale items and if you got it on social media because I like to check them out. And that's pretty much going to do it for this episode. I know it's not the most exciting one, but there is some exciting ones to come into the future. The ones where I'm going to keep Halloween alive all year round. Not sure exactly when I'll be posting them, but it may take a while. But stay tuned. I'll see you guys in the next video. I'll check you later.